Garbage was the hot topic in Toronto this week, and it seemed like everyone had something to say about Mayor Rob Ford bringing in a private company to collect trash for half of the city. The privatized trash collection started Tuesday and will service the areas west of Young Street to the Humber River. The seven-year contract is expected to save the city $11.9 million in the first year of the New Deal. And not everybody, especially some left-leaning councillors, were happy with the service. There were some hiccups, such as delays during the first week, that residents did notice. The only complaint I have, and it's not even a complaint as it came much later than usual, but it was done. Besides that, most of the residents we spoke to seemed to be in favour of the new service. I think it's a great thing. <laughs> Why? Uh, well, because then you have the garbage taking out if those people go on strike, right? And you have a better service, basically. Well, I would try because you can't knock it. You have to try it first. Give it about maybe three to six months. If there's no improvements with the three to six months, they're going to have to come to the table and decide what they should do to better the city for our paying customers because we are paying for it. Hey, can I ask you a few questions here? Uh, Quick, as you work? Right. <laughs> How's it going so far? Very well. Everybody's yeah. happy to see us Absolutely. What has the reaction been from people so far? Everybody seems really happy to see us around. As long as Green for Life learns from their mistakes during their first week, it seems like they'll have many residents that are on their side. For the Toronto Sun, I'm Victoria Potashnik.